Welcome back to my channel guys, it's your girl Coco Styles and on this channel we talk about beauty, fashion and lifestyle. But in today's video I'm going to show you guys a couple of things that I got from Zara for the spring. Um, I'm not really feeling Zara's stuff lately because it's kind of like psychedelic looking and it kind of reminds me of like, I don't know, Austin Powers movie, whatever that movie is called. But um, it's not really my style, but I was able to find some things that I would personally wear. And I think that's fit for us taller women. I'm just going to get started. So I don't know if I'm going to actually pop in pictures or pop in the video or just do it like this, whichever is quicker. But um, I'm going to start with the first outfit and it's this two-piece uh, crinkle halter top um, crop and crinkle skirt. It does have a split in it, which I think the split is a good height for me and my six foot frame. I do have on just some saddle color sandals for now. Um, they were the closest. And I don't know if you guys can see, you probably can see the the, um, the tag back here. I should have pulled it off. Let me pull it off now. Let's pull the tag off. At least the the tag and not the um um so yeah so here's the back of it and I did get a large in this because to me it ran pretty small the medium was really snug around here um but I always had a large top so I thought that I could fit a medium bottom because I'm not that big down here um so I don't have like a lot of hips and stuff guys <laughs> so this is outfit number one let me know what you guys think about this I will link this below because they still have this if they do not have it in the store um, order it online because they still have them online um, so that's this let me know what you guys think and again the whole entire outfit is a large so if you are how much do I weigh Mm, 198 I believe something like that you can get a large but if you are a lot hippier than me it's not that much stretch in this but the top is a large like I said and it does fit pretty snug so um let me know what you guys think and I think it's just enough mid area showing for me I don't have a super flat stomach but I think this is cute enough to where I can keep a little bit showing and still be classy at the same time but let me know what you guys think uh the next couple of pieces i have i have some pants i have some shorts and a couple of tops and another pair of like satiny type of pants here so i'll get those on and let me know what you guys think and again for those of you who are just joining me on this channel i am six feet tall and I weigh like 190 something, maybe 196. I'm thinking 196. And not, I think I'm a, what am I here? Because I feel like it goes up and down. I think I'm a 36D. Yeah. But my back area has gotten smaller. Um, but for whatever reason, I'm still a D cup because I feel like I kind of shrunk a little bit. But get this in a large if you are my size. If you are hippier, you might have a problem with it because I don't think they go up to an extra large. So, I'll get the next outfit on for you guys and I'll be back and let me know what you guys think. Welcome back guys. So, here's the next outfit. This is just a, kind of like a, it's a vase, <laughs> a blazer vest, I guess you would say. Um, I did put a belt on over this. The sides are open. Uh, I do have on a camisole under here. I'm probably not going to wear one under here because the sides are out and I like it. I just put it on for the sake of the video. Um, but it does open on the sides. And here are some shorts that I got from them. The shorts do not have belt hoops. So you can size down if you want it. I didn't want them too tight around my uh, thigh area. So... This is it. And this necklace I actually got from Zara also. Then I just have on some my stowed sandals that are like a cream 
cream color. These are very, very comfortable, guys. And this necklace that I got from Zara as well. So the shorts are from Zara. I'll link these below. I know they still have these. And they're like a camel saddle kind of color. And then the vest. And I think this is kind of, this is really cute. I think this is brunch with the girls. Nothing too serious. You can wear flats with this if you want. Um, do I have flats in here? No. Uh, you can wear flats with this if you want. You can wear hats. Let me see. You know what? Let me try something really quick, guys. I know you guys seen this hat. Well, saw this hat. This Brixton hat. So, you can do something like this. I think this is cute. What do you guys think? Can you see that? I know I'm kind of tall, but hopefully you guys can see the hat. And, um, I don't know where my camera's positioned, but I would wear something like this. Yeah. This is very Rodeo Drive kind of look, guys. <laughs> I don't know if this is too busy. Or maybe not the belt, maybe. But definitely the hat. You can kind of do it with this, too. Um, and just a simple clutch. If I don't wear the hat, then I can just do a simple clutch. My Louis clutch, maybe. Um, or maybe a little go bag. Also... If you didn't want to wear this color belt, I like this belt. You can do a simple gold belt. I have some Zara belts here that are gold. You can just throw over it. Um, but very simple. Very simple. I like this. I haven't gotten to, I didn't get to wear this hat yet. And I plan on it really soon. The weather's been a little shaky here in Atlanta. Um, but let me know what you guys think. Do you like the hat or no hat? Okay, so uh, I'll get into the next outfit for you guys and change some shoes around. I have one, two, three more outfits to go. And like I said, all of these items are still available right now in Zara. And um, I have this stupid tag on here. But I love this. If you want to size down in this vest, you can. However, you have to keep in, uh, take into account that the size does have, like, I tucked it in, but it does have strings. Um, and then you got to remember that it's, the more you pull it, the more this middle piece is going to open up. If you like cleavage, that's fine. If you don't, um, I would say if you are 36C, sorry, D, then I would still get the large and just kind of pull it and tug it how you want it. You just have more room to do that. So I'll get the next outfit on for you guys and be right back. Welcome back, guys. So this is outfit number three. I don't have this tucked in for a reason. I wanted you guys to see where it hit and how the shirt is kind of like tapered, I guess you can say. Yeah, I think it's tapered. Uh, the pants is from Zara also. And these are like a satin drawstring waist um but like I said I want you guys to see the arms fit really well for it to be from Zara um, and me being six feet tall so I think they fit, it fits pretty well but I would personally wear this tucked in inside because sometimes well I like the um I like the drawstring piece I do. I would wear this. I just have on black sandals and um, the wrong bra, of course. And I would probably wear it with my Marc Jacob clutch, which has like a hint of this color in it. Um, let me know what you guys think about this. I like these pants. These are large. They feel really good, and they have. Pockets. <laughs> we all love pockets, right? Let me know what you guys think. I think this is pretty cute. 
my hair sticking up but so these are kind of like some cool locks and I just have on some Stuart Weitzman um sandals nothing too much I realize the older I get my style is definitely changing um I still like sneakers here and there but I'm trying to get sneakers that I can wear with multiple outfits and being a New Yorker to the day I die that's not what I'm used to. I'm used to buying a pair of sneakers or shoes to just to go with an outfit. But cost per wear, ladies, cost per wear, and gentlemen too. Um, I just think it's very important not to just waste money. Um, this is the type of shirt that I would keep for a while. In these pants, because of the color, it's not too bright. I've had this clutch for probably three or four years now. Um, and it's, a, it's just a cute little clutch. Mark Jacob clutch. Let me know what you guys think. And I think that it fits pretty well for me not being so big at the hip. These do have some stretch in it, which is good. Um, there are some pockets in the back on one side. And I think it's cute. Let me know what you guys think. Would you rock this or no? <laughs> I would probably put a small necklace on. I'm not a big necklace person. I'm trying to get... If you guys know any place to buy real gold necklaces, let me know. I've seen a few places, but I kind of feel like it's overpriced. And again, coming from New York City, it's so easy for us to pretty much find a necklace anywhere. That's nice. So this is outfit number three with the flat. I'm sorry, with these uh, sandals. I hope you guys can see it. And that's it for this. And I will get the next one on I have two more because I actually just bought a shirt but I like the it's not linen and it's not satin but it's a really nice material um that I would wear with some jeans and some pumps and then I have some pants I really want to show you guys the pants because if you are six feet these pants fit really well I thought they were going to be super awkward on because of the way they look. They look really wide, but I actually really like them. So I'll be right back with the next outfit, guys. Welcome back, guys. All right, so this is outfit number four. This is my lack of color hat that I did a video on before. And the thing about this hat is I love this hat. I haven't worn it yet, and the reason why is because it's like a cream color, but it has like hint of yellow to it so I was kind of struggling with wearing beige and standard cream with it it just wasn't matching until I came across these pants at Zara now I hope you guys can see where they're hitting me at I have on the same black shoes so these shoes are about hmm, three and a half inches not too high um, and I think they fit really really well I was a little taken aback because they looked really wide but I like how they look on me. And this is just a simple uh, Zara bodysuit. I'm not going to wear this with it. I'll probably do like a one sleever. Um, because these are really low on the side. But you can see the pants. You can see the hat. And there's a one pocket on this side. Uh, there's pleats in it. Two pleats here. And they're pretty high waist because my navel is here and they come up high enough for me um let me know what you guys think about these like i said when you see them in the store they're gonna look <clears throat> really wide <laughs> i was a little scared because i thought that it wouldn't fit me but i was to my surprise there's a, there's a button on the inside the first button that gives it the first um snap and then there's a second one here i'm assuming that if you needed to get it taken in they would probably work with the one in the back but that may affect the, the zipper area. So it's up to you. Just take it to a good tailor. But let me know what you guys think. I have these on. And that's it. And then I'll probably just do a simple black clutch. Something simple, guys. Like, you can go to brunch with a guy, maybe. Maybe even date night. If you don't want to wear pants for a date, I get it. <laughs> but... Um, something simple if you just want to be really, really comfortable for a chill night. Like I said, you don't have to wear something like this. You could wear something with one sleeve, maybe even like a little crop, crop jacket or something. I don't have a black one in here. 
um, or even another color if you wanted to. You don't have to necessarily wear black. I chose black. The buttons are black on here. Um, and let me know what you guys think. Would you rock something like this? All right, let me get on the last outfit. And that's kind of more of a, it's just a shirt. So I am going to throw it on with some jeans and some pumps that I have here that um, I love them because they're like a really pretty color. So I'll be right back with the last outfit and then we'll be done for this Zara haul. I'll be right back, guys. All right, guys, welcome back. So this is the last outfit. This is just the top. Um, like I said, the top is not linen, it's not satin, it just has a really nice feel to it and I absolutely love the color. I have on some cute pumps and some shorts. Now, this is a different look from the last one, but I think if you want to just go out with your girls, early in the day, I think this is simple enough. It's not, and if you don't like shorts like this, you can go for Bermuda shorts, um, uh, the shirt is rather long, so if you're uncomfortable with anything like this, these are not short at all. I'm not a person to wear like really, really short things. Um, but something like this, I think it's really cute. It's simple. The pumps, like I said, are very, hmm, they're like a blush, and I think it's, it's simple. As long as your legs are <laughs> nice and moist. You should be good if you don't feel comfortable with something like this like i said you could always wear bermuda shorts or even jeans if you want but if you want to show a little leg then i recommend some shorts but that's it today guys and i'm trying to think so i bought the gold necklace from zara and there was another necklace i'm gonna give you guys a quick view of both of them up close so you guys can see them let me know what you guys think so uh let me see if you guys can see so this is one of them this is the first one that i had on it's just this and then this is the second one and they're pretty much like a antique color gold i don't know i hope you guys can see that yeah, it's like an antique color. And then this one is similar to that one. Yeah. Yeah. So that's what I got from Zara. I wish they had the belt to match it. But I didn't see any belts. I'm kind of on the hunt for it. So if you guys know any nice gold chain belts, let me know. I really want the Chanel one, but huh, God knows it's so hard trying to find it. And that is something that I would keep for a very, very, very long time. The reason why I like the antique gold is because it doesn't really wear as quickly as the shiny gold, especially if it's like costume jewelry. But anyway, that's it for this video, guys. That's my quick items from Zara. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section. If you'd like more videos like this, comment below. Comment below also if you are a tall lady who struggles finding things to wear. Um, because I know how it can be. But if you stay to the end of this video, please comment Coco We See You. Don't forget to hit that like, comment, and subscribe button. And guys, don't forget to follow me on Instagram at Coco underscore styles underscore NY. So I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.